must have been in the middle of the night. The first bombardment started and it sounded wicked. Bombs flying across the house. Around four or five o'clock, knocks came on the door and they just took my dad away. And they were the Gestapo and the SS, many Gestapo. And um, they were beating him up quite badly, so I told my mum. I said, what's going on? I said, where are they taking Dad? They're probably going to interrogate him. When I went out and say, when is he coming back, my dad? Well, we don't know that. Depends how he behaves. But then we found out he was taken to a concentration camp in Stutova. And my mother, she had a bit of a heart attack or whatever, and they took her to hospital. But then, in the week to come, we just didn't know what was going on. They had invaded that half island, which was classed as Polish property. And they came to the house, and there were people that I even knew. And they sort of said, could you do us an inventory of your house? Well, this is not our house. It belongs to the Polish railway. Back up there. And uh, he said, yes, I know that. I don't want to know about the building itself. Could you take us, could you give us an inventory of everything that you got? I said, what do you mean, such as what? But beds? How many beds have you got? I said, we are three of us in one bed. My brother, my sister and me. Where does your mum and dad? Well, they are in the other bedroom. So you've got two beds. Have you got any wardrobes? What's in the wardrobes? Have you got a sewing machine? Oh, yes. I was quite proud. And we got um, new cutlery and stuff like that we bought. So they said, if you put it all down, we'll be fine. A week later, they came back and they said, you got, got your list? Yes. I said, I got my list ready. So what we're going to do now, everything that's on the list, we got a couple of lorries outside and we'll be loading yours and Mrs. Seifert, your neighbor, and Lewandowski upstairs, Piotrowski, because we got German people coming in now. It's not any more Polish railway, it's the German railway. I said, have you got relatives? I said, yeah, of course we got relatives. Well, you better go and see them today. Yeah, I said, but my mum, she's still away in the hospital and she's not feeling too good. So, well, he said, how old are you? He said, well, I'm 14. You're the eldest, so you're in charge. Take your brother and sister. Anyway, the only one that would take us is our grandma. And she took us in. And uh, until my mum came out. And um, eventually we did get, uh, get a couple of rooms, not far from where she lived. 